Yo, 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 welcome back to the No Regrets Podcast, episode number 26 of No Regrets Podcast, hosted by Yes True DW. And I'm here with my brothers, getting my members. Yo, what's good with y'all? Yo, what's JR back again? What's up? Yo, what's up? You're not going to introduce yourself? Like, what's your name? Bro, my name is Jakai, you know, say G5 Kai. You already know who it is. You already know. <laughs> and this is a somewhat sad episode because this might be Jakai's. Why you looking? Oh, at me? yeah, I was like, damn, my fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Why y'all look at me like that? This might be Jakai's, um, what's it called? Last episode because he got a big boy job. He's moving away from us. Grown going, ass man. Going to the, going to be one of them southern niggas. Yep. A colonizer. You a colonizer? Yeah. <laughs> and you know, since it might be your last episode, I gotta bring your best friend here. I don't really fuck with this nigga <laughs> like that, bro. <laughs> On camera, it's crazy. Hey, bro. I'm playing. You know, y'all yeah, know y'all best friends. But I got a I got a good show for y'all today. We got some good shit. If y'all haven't already, follow us on TikTok at No Regulars. I think we're at 65K. Sheesh. Nigga said when you hit 70K, I'm a I'm officially like tough. You been tough? What the fuck? Actually, Plus, actually we tough. Now your comments begin like it's hella positive. I'm not gonna lie, you're a really good community to be honest with you. Yeah, man. Shout out to all my niggas in the comments, my little gangsters, bro. They be coming crazy at me though. I ain't gonna lie. I think they be you, frying you. <laughs> <laughs> like I ain't gonna lie, they really do. Like does it sound like is my voice really raspy? Yeah, yeah. it is. It's been like that for years. I mean, yeah. damn, I didn't even know. <laughs> Y'all wasn't gonna tell me. You just need to cough, bro. If you just, <clears throat> you know, <coughs> maybe if I drink some water, bro, it's, it's like a natural. It's bro, like, nah, it's, it's a natural. It's, it's, like, it's like Alicia you. Keys. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So like, I always had this voice. Yes. I never. Once you matured, yeah. Damn. You know, back in the day, you sound like the squeaker. That's tough. But if you haven't already, follow us on Instagram at noregulars.podcast. Follow us on all podcasts and platforms at noregulars.podcast. And if you haven't already, subscribe down below. Hit the comment section. Comment. Uh, tell us anything you want to tell us. Go to the DMs. You can DM these niggas if you want to either. You guys don't have to just DM me and shit like that. You know, Jason be waiting for y'all. And um, yeah. yeah, hit the like button. I think we had, we had 700 subscribers already. For real? Yeah, bro. Holy shit. You moving. That's bro, we moving, bro. It's us. It's a us thing. Hey, hey, hey. You know what I'm saying? I make content off of y'all niggas. Yeah. I, That's what it is, bro. You, brother. I can't do this podcast by myself. You think I'm that funny? Damn. <laughs> <laughs> My fault. Uh, hey. But, yeah, I told niggas last episode, if I get to, once I get to 1,000 subscribers and 100K followers on TikTok, we're going to drop some merch. Ooh, yeah. cannot yes, wait. Yes, sir. Yeah, we got some Just good shit coming. Lit. Got some good shit coming. Got some good shit coming. But the first thing I want to talk about, bro, we don't really talk about current events, but some crazy shit going on mm. in the world today, bro. Mm. World War Three is low key starting. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. So what are your thoughts on that? Like, what do you what do you guys are thinking is gonna happen? Um, I'd like to think just like everything else that's happened with the world that it'll just blow over. It'll obviously we're gonna have some deaths and you know tragic yeah. shit, but I'm hoping that it'll blow over and won't get that serious. But from what it looks like, this is literally like so. Uh, what was it? World War One or World War Two? Where they um assassinated French or the Archduke Ferdinand or whatever. Yeah. And that's literally what started the entire thing because it was nations helping their alliances, and then yeah, everything yeah. just goes blows over and shit. Yeah. Bro, I'm just saying if there's a draft, because I heard there was a draft in Ukraine. If there's a draft <laughs> oh, here, yeah. I'm not going. See, I'll say I don't got the choice. I'm already I'm four years on um inactive contract, so. So wait, so do you have to go? Well, so before they do a draft, they obviously are going to send people like Bash that are still in right now. And then if they need, which is crazy because we have hella military that's power, what I'm saying. they will get the people that are inactive like me. And then if that's not enough, if it goes on for years, that's when they do a draft. All right, bet. So we got we got some time. Yeah, you, <laughs> we got you're some chilling, time. You're now. Because I'm not going, bro. I heard they said, uh, they said ages 18 to 60 can't leave the country like mm. men. 60? Yeah. That's kind of crazy. I'm not going to lie. 18 thought, to 60. I thought it was like 26. So you... I mean, that's what in Ukraine. Oh. Like, I seen videos of, like, fathers sending their daughters and mothers away. Like, they're not going to see them again. Mm. That's ad. That's mm. so sad. I'm it's not going to lie. It really is. And I heard they holding it down, though. I heard some nigga went to fire nah, jet going yeah, crazy. Yeah, yeah, What do they call them? They call them, like, the, the ghosts? Yeah, I heard he going crazy. Yeah. The fire jet. Fighter jet. Yeah, there's a fighter oh. jet that took out six uh, Russian aircraft or something like that by himself. Go to Tsushima? Pretty much, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That nigga nice. Apparently that dude's going crazy. Plus, I heard fucking some Russian, like, special forces got rocked by, like, some civilians in um Ukraine, too, so. Hey, as long as they holding it down. I heard something about China going to Taiwan or some shit like that, trying mm-hmm. to take them over. Yeah, they're doing the same shit. Well, so, yeah, like, they've been trying to do that. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. But, like, now it's a good time because, obviously, the, you know, the heat's off them, so. Yeah, I guess. I guess. Yeah. Are they, is it, like, a full invasion or is it just. Who, China or Russia? China. Who, I don't know. I'm not keeping up with them. Mm, okay. 
But Russia is a full invasion though. Hundred percent. Yeah. Like all them niggas just like rushing. Yeah, into he declared war. Bro, think I'm not going. Like, like Jakai, what are you doing if you get drafted, bro? <laughs> well, like, what is your plan? I already, like I like I was in the shower one time and I was thinking like, yo, if I got drafted today, what I'm what am I doing? Bro, like I'm not I'm not doing on no front lines like. Mm. Like if you get drafted, like I'll be in the back, you know. They got like military chefs. I'll do that. <laughs> you gonna? That's cook? possible. It's possible, but they already have those jobs aligned, so you'd be drafted oh, to oh, be infantry, oh, probably. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, you could plead insanity or something. Yeah, just make it to the NBA. You don't gotta go. You think if I break my leg right before they're gonna fuck NBA. me? They don't give a shit. Oh, they gonna still let me go? Hell yes. Well, if you break your leg, I mean, bro, I've seen niggas in the field like broken arms, legs. Bro, they're stop, still out there doing stop, shit, bro. doing training exercises. They just don't put me shit. in jail. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, bro. Just put me in jail. Yo, do you think? Wait, they like prisoners, though? Uh, I, I don't think so. Yeah, send them in right? there. Oh, it's done exactly up. right. That would make sense, but but no. low key, they might just like I'm getting put in go prison. crazy, go yeah. against us, yeah, <laughs> and just start crazy. shooting us. Up. I'm, I'm getting put in prison. Then. Uh, me, too. I was thinking. Yeah, I was like really prepared. Like if niggas come to my door, I'm like, nah, I'm good. Just take me now. So you rather get your butt taken? Yes. Damn. Whoa. Yes. You yeah, said exactly. that too quick. <laughs> you, said that, you said that too quick. Because, first of all, if I'm in jail, I'm not getting my butt taken. Mm. Bro, nigga. Bro, bro, you don't have that choice. It's not like they nah. do that in a regular. Bro, don't be in war, bro. They're not going to be doing stuff like that. Nah. Yeah, I'm, I'm good, bro. Nigga, it's booty time when he feels like it's booty time. You don't got that option. Hey, bro, I ain't. Yo. Nah, they ain't, they ain't taking my ass. I don't know. Nah. Yo, can go to war? Yeah. That's a good question. Bro, people with broken legs can go and watch him. Because <laughs> what are they useful for? They can't carry shit. Do that be obvious. So you're sitting like on the line, right? You're shooting. You got a midget to your right. Are you trusting him? Bro, just keep, just give him my Glock. I'm picking him up and sh- like I'm just throwing him across the field. Like he might but, be my shield, no cap. Like you know, Hasbulla. You guys know who Hasbulla is, little dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That dude. Like, if I see him over there, I'm. <laughs> Bumping that, like I'm kicking them thirty yards, like easy. Like you, they can't even carry the bags. No, no, they can't. So like, what they go? They, they can't uh, even wear like a flack, like a. You know. So I'm guessing they can't go to war then. I Bro, doubt I it. can't carry the bags. I'm out of shape. That's why I'm not going. <laughs> Nigga, they gonna put you in shape. Yeah, nah. they, they, you have to go to boot camp first. Then I'll just send you straight there. Three months. Oh man, you have to go to boot camp first and then go to war. That's crazy. Nigga, I'm not doing that. Yeah. I'm really not. I'm really prepared to go to jail. I'm prepared. Oh, yeah, I'm so good. how would you go to jail though? What would you do? If I go to jail? No, I'm saying, like, what would you do in order to get to jail? I mean, doesn't just refusing put you in jail? Yeah. Does it really? Yeah. I think so. Uh, sure. Maybe then, yeah. Sure. I feel like I feel like they're going to keep asking me, and then eventually they're going to be like, all right, we're just going to put you in jail. But is it, I don't know if it's like prison, prison. I feel like it's just like a special jail. Hmm. Possible. If it's a special jail, like, where it's not like I'm not maximum prison, I'm probably going to be there for like a year or two, I'll do that shit. I'm not. It might be more. Bro. Because like like what like five yeah just you look you going against the country technically they going against me it's uh, my freedom it's better it's better than dying am I lie that's what yeah, I'm dude. saying it's better than dying because I know I already know I'm gonna die in such an ass so, way I mean, y'all worried about like the draft or whatever what I'm worried about is this nigga said he's gonna blow up the world if he doesn't yo, get his way yo, he said he, he said I am going to blow up the world you just reminded me it's crazy I, like I know us and Russia are like the world leaders in nuclear warheads mm-hmm. but like. I was like, I was afraid, right? So this is what I'm thinking, right? So you know how World War II started, how we got involved, low key was with like pro- Japan, yeah. yeah, Japan and shit. Like imagine that shit happens to us, like right now, like some random country, like freaking China or Bombers. <clears throat> just sent nukes to to New York City. That's why I was thinking in my head when I, when they said we was going to so, war. I mean, the thing with I that, that New York is, City like, be the main target. Why? It's mad people in in a dense area. Damn. That's I was gonna say like, you know, we're in Jersey. They ain't worried. They go. <laughs> they said no shit over here, but like. Nah, bro. Bro, nuke, nuke the Capitol, bro. New York City's right there. Bro, go nuke. They're going to nuke the Capitol, uh, New York City, Chicago, LA, Miami, all the big cities, bro. And then we're going to go to war. I'm going to have to get drafted because I'm angry now because yeah. some shit happened. Nah, I'm not. Nah, bro. Like, I was really, like, I had a whole scenario in my mind. Like, what if they just sent nukes the, the second day? Mm. Or somebody. I don't know who. Like, somebody's like, there's people in, like, a fleet of ships, like, in freaking... Like Pearl Harbor and shit. Like we don't even detect them niggas. Bro, I'm not ready for the end of the world quite yet. I'm not ready. Hey, bro. We love the Ukrainians, bro. But I'm sorry, but we not we not risking our lives. It's just crazy. Yeah, y'all, y'all look like you're doing a great job. I'm not gonna lie. That's what I'm saying. They chilling right now. <laughs> they, can, they can defend for themselves. They defend. got fucking Poland and shit helping them out. Like, oh, they do. I'm pretty sure. Is right? Poland part of NATO? I'm pretty. Mm, I don't know, but I'm pretty sure that like Russia wants to take Poland too. Because if they something. take, because I heard if like Russia takes any of the NATO countries, then we have to like help. Mm. 
That's what I'm saying. Like, like, like don't, don't touch that shit, bro. Leave them niggas alone. I don't want to get involved, bro. I really don't. Like, uh, if they send nukes, bro. I heard Russia has like the biggest bomb too. Like, Probably. I thought, was, I thought that was China. One of them niggas have. It's either one of them. China, I mean, China, China has an artificial sun. We talked about it last time. Mm-hmm. They just built an artificial sun, bro. I don't even want to know what they could do. What if they just dropped the sun? <laughs> On us? Yeah. <laughs> then what? Then what? Hey, no, no. The world and the world, like you said, bro. Literally, I ain't ready for that shit. Mm-mm. But um, oh, speaking of the end of the world, bro, I got like these. So I look, I seen this on the internet, right? Mm. They said, they said there's eight possible apocalypses that will end like human life, and I, I just wanna, I'm gonna bring it up to see if we can actually like to see if we can survive it, like but with our opinions and shit okay. like that. All right, so the first one, hold on. All right, so. It's, it's called the eight things most likely to destroy humans. So the first one is climate change. So say like there's like a drastic change in the climate. Like it gets mad cold like the ice years. age. Years. It would take years to do that. But like imagine like that. Like you think humans will be able to survive that or you just be done up? Um. Yeah. No, actually. Yeah, I think so. Like a big ass ice age? Yeah. Or like if everything just gets mad hot? Ooh, mad hot is crazy. I mean. Because the water source will drain up. But cold, yes. What do you think, Jukai? I mean, climate change also affects, like, the chemicals. Low-key, like, I think it's, like, destroying the atmosphere. So, if that's done. Oh, well. oh yeah, that's true. That's true. Hmm. Nah, we done up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we, we did? We done up. All right, how about... All right, this one's our Adida. How about an asteroid attack? <laughs> you think we got one punch, man? You think someone's going to punch <laughs> the asteroid? Yeah, it's done up. Hey. No, nah, I mean, we got asteroid protection. Like what? You shoot it before it You're going to shoot it and it's going to split into a million pieces and still bro, destroy a lot. Bro, bro. It would disintegrate it. You know how big an asteroid? It's just, you think we got laser? Well, we different probably sizes. do have laser beams, but yeah. like... You think we're going to... I don't know, bro. It's possible. We, we might be able to shoot I'm down an asteroid like down to A few pieces ash. might come down, but we should be able to destroy it where it won't... Like, know, kill the whole Earth? Yeah. Might be. If it's, a, if it's a big asteroid, we should see it coming. Can you imagine That's being the nigga in charge of shooting down the asteroid? What if you <laughs> miss? Like, like, what if you miss? <laughs> like, like, I'm pretty... <laughs> I'm pretty sure yeah. they're they're guided missiles. It's gonna be all right. Nah, just imagine like, but what if like some shit goes wrong? Nah, if you miss, you so ass. Yeah, a, <laughs> you really just you really just took the biggest L like on the planet. Like, <laughs> like you killed us all. Yeah, that's that's terrible. But then again, like, how would you even train for that? I don't know. You can't train for shit. I mean, you, you we never know. They probably train for some other shit that we don't even know about. Probably they probably got super gravity suits where they can jump high as fuck. That'd be so tough. I don't know, bro. Like super suits. Yeah. Shit. I'd be so. T- I wouldn't be surprised if they got super suits, bro. They probably have something like that. Like think about it. Like, I feel like like an, a millionaire. Somebody got like like a billion dollars or five hundred thousand dollars. A nigga definitely might could make a super suit. Yeah, like if he a wants robot to. suit, you think? Yeah. That'd be so fucking. Tough. That would be probably so do. fire. Like a superhero, nigga. Yeah. Shit. Should probably like ten million, if not more. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But I mean, that's play money to him, unfortunately. To them niggas, they can like like Elon Musk, bro. He probably has a fucking. Titan armor. Oh, you saw he had that uh, that gun. I forget what it was. What? It, sh- it like shot a fireball. <laughs> what? Elon Musk made it. Oh. I guess like a weapon. Probably. I mean, <laughs> that nigga can do whatever he wants. He can do whatever he wants. <laughs> that nigga alien, bro. You think so? I, I think Mark Zuckerberg's an alien. The Facebook dude. Yeah. You ever seen him take a sip of water? No. Nah, he's a freak for real. Bro. What? <laughs> that boy is a freak for real. Nah, you gotta watch that video later. Of him sipping water. Yes, bro. Like, it wasn't out of water, but he went. Like nah, bro. Just didn't look. He's a lizard. He's a lizard for real. Like he's he's reptile. He do look kind of weird though. Like he don't look like he blink. He, he do don't. look like his facial expression is like mad, like blank. And then almost like every single conference call or like video he takes, there's Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce in the background. Hmm? Every single time, like he has it on his shelf in his living room, like Sweet Baby Ray's barbecue sauce. Really? Yes. <laughs> he's a freak, bro. He's a freak for real. Like, hey, bro. That nigga might be those lizard people. I don't know is. about that though. All right. The next one is an alien attack. Done up. Done up. We're not fighting aliens. I done think, up. Yeah. How how we stopping aliens unless we're making like a peace treaty with them? It's done up. What kind of alien are you talking? Hey, I feel you like any Marvel aliens. Nah, I like feel like Captain any, Marvel. Nah, up. nah. Any, any alien, I think we're dead. I'm not gonna lie. It's done up. There's no way in hell. We're like ants compared to them niggas. Yes. Like these movies be making us think we could fight aliens and win. Like de- uh like freaking Independence Day and all that that shit is we not could happening. Literally, yeah. just be a reality show for the them. You know, is- they probably they for us they could probably watch us and be like, damn, this is like good TV. Like I'm <laughs> telling you, like nigga, we're nothing to them. That's so crazy. So you think we dead? Hell yes. Yeah. The thing is, if they got here, that means they came here from like a galaxy away, which means they're more advanced. 
by far. Exactly. Like, just just by getting here. Yeah, just by getting here is done. <laughs> That's tough. That's so tough. All right. How about nuclear war? Um. Mm, so I mean, the Fallout game series is somewhat true. Hey, unless you die instantly. It'd be nuclear yeah. nuclear Fallout. Some people would live and repopulate, but it'd be shit. Like niggas like. Like in the game or whatever, they use bottle caps as money, as currency. Really? Yeah, like bottle caps. So <laughs> like metal or paper, plastic. Uh, I think it's metal bottle caps, like soda bottle caps. Shit. So that's how like down bad shit is, bro. Yeah. Wow. So it's possible because obviously people have fallout shelters and stuff, but yeah. like most of the population, if you went to nuclear war, done up. Everything's just gonna be. They would have to repopulate. Yeah. Dang. So we we I think yeah. So we should be good though, right? Yeah. These things we should be good though, Jakar. It'd be a wasteland, though. So, like, the issue with that is, like, the chemicals that would be, like, left over. Yeah. The radiation would be crazy. It'd be terrible. Like, very, very bad, but possible to live. Mm. Mm, oh, yeah, I see that. I know what you mean. So, Russia, don't send them bitches over because we're we going to censor it back and it's just going to get bad. Free us, bro. For real. All right. Syn- synthetic biology. So, that's, like, creating shit. Huh? Like, creating new animals, creating recreating dinosaurs. Like imagine niggas recreated dinosaurs and like I don't, populated the earth. I don't think there's any animal that could possibly take us out of a human race. To I don't be think honest. so either. We're, we're Unless probably. we make something that's just as smart as us. Mm, now like a sentient, uh, if it was like sentient and it was like smart like us and it was like self aware, maybe, but I doubt it. Yeah. So I think probably just, not. Yeah, I think it would be straight. Yeah. If like dinosaurs roam the earth. We're f- fucking rocking dinosaurs <laughs> now. Like, we're destroying them niggas. Easy. Unless the what if it's Godzilla? They couldn't take out Godzilla. King Kong. Mm. We're making a we're making an ape just as big. <laughs> <laughs> so you think we straight? Yeah, I think so. And plus, like, I think, isn't King Kong like um, self aware or whatever? Isn't he like yeah. conscious? So yeah, we he can talk, We can talk to him. He talked to that little girl. Yeah, we can lock him up. Yeah, all right. We straight. Global pandemic. COVID. Uh, maybe something a lot worse. I mean, yeah, because we we survived um, the yellow fever, black plague. Mm-hmm. Way back when, that's when we had way less technology and science and stuff. So yeah, that's so true. How the hell do we survive that? Some people didn't get bitten by rats. Mm. But rats. I mean, they couldn't even travel far back then. Oh yeah, you know, yeah. They, so they, they just they like had planes, so they oh, travel that fast. That makes sense. So niggas just like stayed put and just like if niggas are sick, they just leave them in like the forest or some shit like and that. They might walk to the next village, but <laughs> 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 oh shit, bro. All right, yeah. So I think we will survive that. I think eh, yeah, that's not that bad. Mm-hmm. We we. We went through COVID already. Honestly, are we still in the pandemic right now? Technically. Yeah. Technically, right? Because I don't be wearing my mask that much. I don't. I was the only one to stop a shop today without it. It's really? Up for that, I forgot it. <laughs> it is done up for masks. Yeah. Very done up. All right. So how about a super volcano? Like erupted. Uh, how big really? Like, I like mean, we're huge, not in, we're not in Pangea though. So, I mean, just some people will get fucked. Not all. Yeah. Like I heard there's like a big ass volcano in, um, what's that shit called? Uh, Yellowstone. Mm. If that shit blew up, it's gonna like, like the hat, like the west side of the earth is gonna be like fucked up. Psst, fuck the, the entire west side. West side. Either east side. west side or like North America, South America type shit is gonna be like covered in like. Oh yeah, like ash, the, the ash and stuff. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Damn, it's tough for them though. Look out. Yeah, it's tough for the west side, yo. Mm. My boy John over there. Mm. Done up for you. But Where's he living? He's in Colorado. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> You're right up. there too. Done up. Free that nigga. Yeah, we should be good. All right. I think, yeah, I think we'll find a way to, like, either, because, like, I heard the only pa- bad part about that is just, like, imagine that shit's, the, the ash is over, like, the sun and shit, and you can't grow shit no more. Yeah. For, like, a long period of time. It depends how long it's going to take. But I feel like we'll find a way. Nah, we're being chilling. All right. And then the last one is artificial intelligence. Done up. We we lose every day of the week. <laughs> I'm not even trying to be funny. If robots become self-aware AI, it's done up. 100%. I mean, we already rely on shit like our phones and our computers so imagine this shit got the mind of its no m- done mind up. of its own done up like nigga i'm not gonna lie i don't think we'll, they'll probably rule the world like we'll probably have to hide no, be we'll probably be slaves and shit yeah no 100 percent. there's a um thing called like the basilisk uh basilisk theory of like a sentient ai became self-aware to answer any question that is possible like on the planet which is possible because they're they're genetically modified to do such yeah we would literally it'd be done up Really? Yes. If they can answer everything, like, is God real? What happens after death? It's done up for us. If they can answer this, like, certain type of questions, it's done up. You know, I seen a, there was like, I think there was like a um certain type of, like, AI that could, like, create a face that's not real. Done up. That's scary. Like, it's scary as fuck. Like, it makes human pictures, and they'd be like, they're, they're not real humans. Like, they're not, they don't exist. But, like, what they know of what humans look like, they could just make it up. 
That shit looks like a random face. Look like I a random can't, face. I can't even make up a random face. Like that I shit's can't. crazy. Nah, it will be done up. It's bro. stupid done up. Like they're easy. I'm talking with ease. Like it wouldn't even probably take a year. The minute um one became self aware, he's building others, and it's done up. Oh, facts, facts, facts. Like imagine they can make a color. <laughs> like you know how hard it is to make a new color. It's done. I mean, think about it. Is there any colors we haven't found out about? That's yet? what I'm saying. So how the fuck? How the yeah. fuck you gonna make a like? Think about it. <laughs> like think about it. You really can't make a new color. Like if if somebody come out with a new color, that's, that's like groundbreaking. Yeah. Like and they'd no, probably be able to do such. So that's crazy. Like I can't even. Like I like I was going throughout my like today. I seen that somewhere. Like like making a new color is like some crazy shit that we can't physically do no more. No. So I was going throughout my day looking trying to find new colors. I really couldn't find one. Colors they go in a circle and like you can't really. That's what I'm saying. So you can't physically make a new color. Like we don't, we can't comprehend anything new because we haven't seen some shit like that. Mm. That's some crazy shit, bro. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, oh. I think that's all the shits. AI. So I think <laughs> we can survive about like a few of them though. Yeah. yeah. Like half of them. But if I feel like if they know how to like like fix themselves, it's over. Done up. Like how the it's fuck done. they just gonna keep coming back? It's done up. It's just gonna be an endless war of us fighting, freaking uh. What's it called? Robots and shit. I ain't with that, bro. I ain't getting drafted that. Mm-mm. So we gonna survive climate change. Yep. Are we surviving an asteroid with the, if they had a laser? Yeah. Asteroid. It's light. We're not surviving aliens. Nope. Nuclear war will survive. Synthetic biology will survive. Global pandemic will survive. Super volcano and artificial intelligence. Done up. So we're n- we're surviving six out of eight. That's not that bad. That's not, that's not horrible. We good. We good. Yeah. All right, we live Should be. Shit. All right. So I got a, I got a would you rather question, bro. Mm. So do you guys know who Kimbo Slice is? Yeah. All right. So would you rather street fight Kimbo Slice for two minutes? No. Or fight prime Mike Tyson in a round of boxing? I'm fighting Mike Tyson. Yo, that's Kimbo a- Slice hit somebody in the eye so hard to dislocate his eye and it popped out the socket. I'm- or something <laughs> like that. It's crazy. I'm good. How long is a round of boxing? Two, uh... three minutes or five minutes? No, no. That's like UFC. UFC's five. So our round is like what two and a half or three? Might be three. So three minutes with Mike Tyson. I'm rocking Mike Tyson. You rocking? Nah, I'm not. <laughs> but I'd rather just get knocked out of one punch rather than like Kimbo Slice destroying me. Destroying your face? Yes. For two minutes. Easily, he's fucking my face up. Easy money. At least with uh, Mike Tyson, there's rules and regulations. Kimbo Slice don't give a fuck. I know. That's sh- yo. His fights used to be crazy. I don't know Kimbo Slice. You don't know what? Kimbo? You never seen the the street fights he had? It's the all right. You ever watched um? You ever watch Drake and Josh, the, the Christmas movie? <laughs> he was over. the guy in jail. Yeah. Do you remember at the end, there was a black dude with a beard that came down the chimney of Santa Claus? The big Aki dude. Did he, the, have, did he have sideburns? Did he have sideburns? He has a beard. He has a beard. I don't know. Like, you remember the Christmas movie when they was with the, the little orphans? Yeah. Yeah, at the end. I can't remember. Damn. Kimbo Slice, that was bro. Kimbo, bro. That nigga used to fuck niggas up. Like, if you look up, like, Kimbo Slice, like, fights... He just be in the back of like a Popeye's just like fighting niggas. <laughs> and that actually got him like he's a, a real person. Yeah, he's yeah. a real person. I he think was in the UFC for a bit too. That that street fighting shit got him UFC job. I'm not going to lie. Crazy. Hold on. Kimbo Slice is that boy, bro. Oh, I seen him. That nigga. He's the real fucking deal for real. Like bare. Was it bare hands or did he have gloves on? No, uh, I think it was bare knuckle for some of them. I don't know why those niggas was fighting him. Pride. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck all that. Nigga like UJ would say yes. UJ will f- nah, I don't think I don't think UJ, UJ getting f- his ass beat. <laughs> getting his ass whooped for being prideful. <laughs> I still I don't think he will fight Kimbo though. Nah, he's the most prideful. Nah, low key I know. might take Kimbo other than Mike Tyson. I think he, yeah. I'm not taking Kimbo, bro. I'm not taking. So hell no. What you gonna do, Jukai? I'll take Kimbo. Dumb as fuck. <laughs> Why? I'll take Kimbo, bro. Dumb. Hey. I'm not gonna lie. Hell no. <laughs> All right. So. But you guys watch UFC? Yeah, I actually just started getting into UFC. Where? So you? I started watching like a like a year ago. Like I used to watch what's that nickname? Israel Adesanya. Yeah, that nigga nice. Is he? He's the boy style bender. Yeah, he's tough. The my favorite part is when that nigga was um he was fighting somebody, and it was like the last round. He looked at the nigga. He's like, I'm prepared to die. Ever since I seen that, that shit really motivates he's me. He's so life. tough. And he fucked that nigga up. But I was saying that because. You think we could jump Ronda Rousey? Just us three? Hell yes. You think we could be oh, <laughs> fucking her ass up, boy? Yo, Ronda Rousey. Yes. Prime Ronda Rousey. Yes. 
We all could jump her. Yeah. WWE superstar? Yeah. Three of us can't take her? No. Dumb as fuck. What's three? <laughs> Who? What's right three. here? Ronda Rousey. All you gotta do is get rocked in the face once and I'm rear naked. She's in She's in a choke. It's done up. You just, well, she's about to like spin kick you. Yeah, spin kick me. She's gonna be fighting you or Darius. I know. Or one me. of us is gonna get fucked and up. I'm not gonna lie. One of us comes in from behind, <laughs> puts her in it. Honestly, all you have to do is slip one punch and by the time she's throwing that punch... But I feel like, like she's gonna eat that bro, shit. she's gonna eat it, bro. I didn't say you have to hit her. Put her in a submission, <laughs> bro. She, oh. she getting out of that. No oh, fuck she's not. <sighs> I don't know. I feel like... You underestimate her. I feel like we either gonna get fucked up or somebody gonna get fucked up really badly. There's nothing you you understand. If I put you in a rear naked, there's literally if I wrap my legs around you and my arm is around your neck and I'm locked in, you cannot move. You're not you're not leaving. I know, but like you don't think she trains shit for shit like that? Sure. Like, <laughs> three of us is crazy. I don't know. She's pretty Aki, bro. If you would have said Brock Lesnar, no. But her? Yes. Yeah. I mean Brock Lesnar, what, like six four, two eighty? Like yes. that nigga's fucking us up, bro. That boy's a demon. So Wait, you think we can fight? We can jump her? Hell yes! I'm like fifty fifty. How about you, Jakai? I don't think I don't know. It's not gonna be easy. This dude talking like he's walking apart. It is, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? Three. I know he's giving us like play by play shit yes. that's gonna happen. Hundred percent. One of you guys gets fucked up. The other two are gonna get the job done. It's easy. Sorry, Jakai. You might have to yeah, get fucked up. Yeah, it's done for you. Like oh, you yeah. might have to go I'm in first. And she's... I'm running around. She's not catching me. So. <laughs> 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 Nigga, we got a jumper. You can't run away. You can't bro, run away. she sprint at you. What you? What I'm gonna do? Nigga, if you don't low cut her or something, yeah, low cut her. You know she's a professional fighter. <laughs> yeah, she asked though. Damn. <laughs> hey, Way bro. out of her prime. I mean, now nah, she's in her prime now. I'm still doing it. <laughs> still <rocking laughs> Yo, all right, all right. I got another question for y'all, bro. This is this is kind of sick. I'm not gonna lie. Mm. So, what's the worst thing you're doing for a billion dollars? <laughs> well, see, this is subjective though, because like first thing that popped in my head. It's sound homophobic. You suck dick, right? But that's, obviously not, <laughs> that's obviously not the worst thing because it's subjective. Like, a nigga, like, no, well, I almost name dropped. That's Someone that's thing. gay would be like, I'm sucking dick easy for a billion dollars. Yeah, so that's I, what I'm saying. Because like, let me give you examples. Yeah. All right, um, so say say you go to the hospital. You shut off all the power in the hospital. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what, just staying there? No, you cut off all the power in the hospital. You're so killing you're, everybody on life support. Oh. <laughs> yeah. All right. For a billion? For a billion dollars. Hell yes. I'm sorry, bro. Jakai, are you doing that? Uh, <laughs> what, is, what is this moral obligation yeah. bullshit you're doing? You're a good heart, I, I bro. Promise that's, I'm not. That's good. That's a good. I don't even want money that much. Can I get away with it? Hell yeah. Yeah. You're sick. I can you're I can, sick. <laughs> most people on life support are pretty much done for. Oh, like, bro, that's, that's, really, that's really not true. There's Potatoes, people, old people. people. On comas who come back. Yeah, but. <laughs> like, you, like, by turning off all that power, you probably have like 30 bodies immediately. All right. Wow, it's a billion dollars. <laughs> All right, how about um, you go to the you go to the zoo right with a toaster, you go to the aquarium, and you throw the. <laughs> bro, that's easy, bro. I don't care about no. I hate I hate fucking sea animals. <laughs> so you go kill all them yeah. animals in the aquarium. <laughs> Hell yes, <laughs> nigga, you give me you give me a damn I'll shotgun. Do, I'm going in there and blowing I'm blowing Bengal tigers to smithereens. I, I, don't, I don't like water. I don't like water. <laughs> so yeah, so you just gotta kill all the for a million. The, nah. no, for a billion dollars. I'm doing it for a million. Right, what, so. if there's wow. a, what if there's a kid in the tank? Then no. Okay, okay. So you're not killing. I'm people. still dropping that bitch. <laughs> Are you crazy? All right. How about how about to kidnap somebody? Ah. Uh, and then do what? That's that. I don't you know. don't gotta do nothing. You just gotta plan a kidnapping. I don't for think a billion dollars. I can't kidnap anybody. I don't think I can. That's that's crazy. You can kill them but not kidnap. Niggas on life support are pretty much done for. Bro. Fish or fish kidnapping somebody is crazy. You said you were gonna kill a kid. I didn't say all that. <laughs> in, the, in the fish tank, you said you were still doing it. If he was in there, I wouldn't lose any sleep over it. <laughs> oh. But, but kidnapping is where you draw the Kidnapping is crazy. So, yeah, those are like examples of like that. Shit's so like that. Do you guys like think of anything else that's worse, that could be worse than that? Um, Because that's some sick shit. I ain't going to lie. I'm really not doing nothing that bad. I'm going to be honest. I, I'm not fiending for a billion that badly. Nah, that's true. Would I think you, the worst thing. Would I'm you a, light an orphanage on fire? No. <laughs> I didn't say no one had to die. Would you do it, though? No. You're destroying their homes. Bro, someone's going to die. <laughs> no, okay, let's say no one dies. Kids are hard-headed, bro. Okay, no one dies. They have no home. You still doing it? No. Nah, you, can't, you can't assure me no one's going to die. Yeah, hypotheticals. No one's going to die. Nah, I don't think I'm doing that nah. shit. you doing that? <laughs> All right, how about, how about you 
So say you're on an intersection, right? Yeah. For a billion dollars, you gotta run back and forth ten times. Like you gotta do suicides. Oh, that's late. I'm, I'm bobbing and weaving. What time of intersection? Like 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 in, 20, like, like in L. A. Twenty two. No, not twenty two. That's only two. I mean a long ass one. Like like Route One. Like how many like how many lanes middle? are there? Route One is like no more, there's, no there's less three. than five lanes. Oh, five. What's like what's this Florida? I know Florida got like yeah. seven nah, lane son roads. Up. I can't. You don't think you can do that? Niggas are blazing down that. Route, <laughs> That's what bro. I'm saying. You got. If I get rocked once, it's done up. I'm pretty much either paralyzed or dead. <sighs> for for a billion dollars though, I'm gonna try though. Mm. I think I'm gonna try. You yeah, gonna I'll, die? I'll, I'll attempt. I don't think I'm gonna die. I'm not getting hit. Mm. Oh, you gonna be weaving them? Yeah. <sighs> no, bro. They're going eighty. Hundred on getting the hit. speedway. You're, You're getting just, hit. They won't just hit me, you know. Yeah, I mean they won't, but like you might cause like mass traffic, like mass like. Car accidents. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> bro, if it's a lot of cars, bro, they don't they don't even be driving that fast. If it's, if it's a lot so you're gonna cars, you're gonna be... get that suicide. So you're doing tense like one. Yeah. Yeah. I'd be smoking ninety down twenty two. What you think they do in the real one? Too sick. On twenty two. I'd be driving hella late though. I'd be driving. Oh, okay, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Ah. He's capping anyway. Jason be driving slow. Yeah. <laughs> With niggas in the car, cause like you know I'm responsible for your lives. Me. Mm. Shit. All right. Here's another scenario, right? So say, so say you're in a pool, right? You're in like a, like a, like you know, a YMCA type pool. You're at one edge of the pool. You have to swim to the other, but somebody's as soon as you go within two seconds, somebody's dropping in piranhas. I'm good. You think you're gonna make it? Yeah. For a billion dollars. You know yeah. how big piranhas are. I seen them shits is like this big. Like then I thought they I thought I piranhas were like this big. Head start? Yeah, two second head start. Wait, wait, where am I? As soon as you start flailing, there it go. How, how far am I swimming? Like you know, like the pools in the YMCA. It's like a not Olympic size, but it's like the entire thing. Yeah, you gotta go all the way down. I can't swim that fast. So <laughs> I right. might be able to. <laughs> That's craziness. Mm. Because even Olympic bro, Olympic pro, swimmers can't outrun clean, clean you to the bone, bro. I know. I think I can make it. I'm not saying I'm gonna avoid the piranhas, but I think I can make it all the way. Like two seconds of one. You're gonna get out the water. There's still gonna be piranhas on you. Yeah. And pro- them niggas like, is huge. You have, you have bones sticking out. For you got a billion dollars, dollars though. I'm about that Wolverine bones. About that metal in me. Mm. After after that billion dollars, bro. Yes, sir. That's, that surgery about to take two hundred mil out. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? You like, <laughs> damn. It's possible though. I think. I don't think I can swim. You can swim that fast. You can not swim that like- fast. I'm not like an Olympic swimmer, but you I'm can- confident that I can reach the other side of the pool without dying. Oh, I think Cause like once they get you That shit gonna hurt You're not gonna wanna swim fast well, I mean your Adrenaline's going Yeah So like oh, I don't know Wasn't that in one of like The Piranha movies I've never seen any of them Oh you never I think there was like a, a part where Did you watch it Jakai Did you watch that part Where somebody was in the pool And somebody threw like Piranhas in there They threw Piranhas in there Yeah Wait, What movie are you talking about <laughs> Was it Piranhas or Draw You I saw this movie called Piranhas Yeah this movie called oh, Piranhas I thought, I thought that shit happened I'm pretty sure it was like At the beach Mm. All right, let me let me think of another one. Fucking um. All right, you got you have um you have football gear on, right? Head on collision with a bus. Wait, what? What I do? What dollars. the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> nigga, there's no limit. <laughs> nigga, just said, just said, nigga said basically put on a fucking piece of paper and get hit by a bus. It's the same <laughs> shit. You're getting rot. You get you might you might not die. Yeah, like it's not the bus is not gonna keep going. Like as soon as it hits you, it's gonna like break. Bro, we're flying. <laughs> okay, you're flying for a billion dollars. Not only flying, like either my shoulder is gonna be you got in, in my chest, broken or, ribs. Or my head. Okay, broken ribs. But now you're doing so. You're gonna go into a pool and swim against piranhas. But there's a little bit more control with that. I guess, but Where's like <laughs> bus hitting you, it's done up. You got arm. You got a little bit of armor on. You got pads. You got a helmet. So you're not going. You're not going. You might not die. You're you might be, just. You'll be a vegetable. No, you're not gonna be a vegetable. If a bus coming like thirty miles an hour and like it's not gonna run you over, it's just gonna hit you. All right. How about this? Would you take a free throw for fifty billion dollars? But if you miss, you die. I ain't gonna lie. That's kind of scary. Yeah. <laughs> fifty billion. Yeah. It's a free throw. Do I have practice or it's like off the wake up? Because mm. if it's off the wake up I might be a little shaky Because that shit That, that mental it, It's not Free throws is not about shooting It's just your mental Because you're yeah, just up there You have the mental That you're going to die on the line Yes That's what I'm saying 
And I might just be thinking about that. And when yeah. I miss, I'm like, fuck. Yeah, set up. The minute the minute the, the bitch <laughs> doesn't go in the hoop, <laughs> shot. <sighs> How much am I getting? Uh, I feel like 50 billion is a lot. So let me let me lower it down to a billion. For to for a billion dollars. Yeah. For <laughs> That's what I'm saying, nigga. I'm not taking it. I don't I'm know, bro. I've asked for that's really. That's reminding me of practice when I couldn't make the free throw. <laughs> yo, people, this nigga Jakai. If I couldn't make the free throw for suicides, I'm not sure. Every yo, for, every for suicide, <laughs> every free throw we missed was a suicide, and like we went down the line of the teammates, and we made it to Jakai. I swear to God, we was running for a good like 20, 30 minutes. He had to make. He had to make two in a row, right? Mm-hmm. He couldn't make two, bro. Oh shit! I was making the first one. But he wasn't making the second one. <laughs> Shit was crazy, bro. We was so mad at him, bro. I don't know. I don't think that's scary to die. Yeah. Nah. Just die. <sighs> nah, I don't think I'm doing that, bro. All right, cool. What about if um your significant other was on the line? Like, it doesn't have to be a girlfriend. It could be you know someone significant to you, like family, like immediate family, like mom, dad, sister, or girlfriend if you like. That, you shoot the free throw, I'll put $10 billion or they die. Nah. Why would I even do that? Nah, I'm not. I don't know. Maybe you fear your own death, but you know, someone else gets smoked. Maybe it's a little bit better for 10 bill. Nah, I'm cool. I'm still not. I'm not. What are you doing? It depends who it is. Oh. It honestly depends who it is. <laughs> your father. Who? I love you, Dad. I really do. <laughs> Me and him ain't that close, though, bro. I might take that shot. <laughs> mother, though, no shot. No way. Dad? I'm not going to lie. <laughs> if you shoot that... And you make it, you gotta give your dad like a mil- uh, like how much? Ten billion? Yeah. You gotta give him like a billion dollars. He he, he get five hundred thousand. Oh wow. <laughs> five hundred thousand, bro. Wow. All right. So I got I got another would you rather question, right? Mm-hmm. Would you rather fall into a cactus or sprint through like a hundred feet of uh glass barefooted? Cactus. Like just fall into it. Yep. Fall into a cactus. Do you yeah. understand like? The clash is like tear your feet to like. I know, but like, rings. but like, what if you fall in a cactus? That shit go in your eye. Fuck it, fuck it, <laughs> dude. My feet would get fucking like. Falling mu- cactus from where? Mutilated. Uh, you fall in a cactus from like twenty feet, twenty feet high, or you're running, you're sprinting through broken glass, like a hundred feet of broken glass, like full sprint. Well, will sprint through. It's tattoos is low-key going through you. Fuck so, it. So that glass is creepy. Low key, I might bro, be just running through glass. Bro, I'm not gonna cat, lie. Cat, I was just looking because me and John are going to a reservation. Like the cactus, bro, some of the thorns are really long. Like they're going through. Are they are if they thick? Yes. If you're fall if you're falling into them, like that could really kill you. Like, it's really gonna punt, like impale you. That's worth uh, you go, bro, my feet you're getting, <laughs> you're gonna die. What? <laughs> feet getting mutilated is crazy. Bro, you're gonna die. You you're just gonna be, gonna be on a you gonna be on a wheelchair for a little bit, you know what I'm saying? A like little bit, bro. You can fix you up could, your feet, bro. You could literally destroy all your nerve endings, and then you can't walk. Okay, and then you can also die from falling on a cactus. You're gonna die from falling on a cactus. You're falling on a cactus. It's gonna impale you. No, it doesn't go that deep. If you're falling from 20 feet, what do you mean? Literally, gravity's gonna put you all the way through. I'm not dying from no cactus. Mm. Right, you said you gangster like that. All right, <laughs> all right what about what about slitting? Like paper cutting your eyes right here. Like your the side of your eye. Yeah, like the side of your eyes and side of your mouth. Or like I'm talking about rub your hand on the concrete to bone. Uh, wait, uh, does this hurt that bad? I'm trying to think. What do you say? He said like paper cuts here and here on your eye. Like I'm talking about pull this out, slit it in here or rub your hand on the concrete to bone. I'm definitely, I'm slicing this shit. I don't know. Yeah. I don't, I don't even know what. Bro, would you rather? Which one would you rather do? Rubbing on the concrete? Till bone. Yeah, I'll get a paper cut. Oh, I'm about to say. I don't know. If you would have said, like, cut in between here like this, like with the scissors, that, oh my God. That's, a, <laughs> that's the same thing? the same thing here. Bro, imagine, sl- have you gotten a paper cut recently? Nah. Them fuckers hurt. Like, for real. <laughs> Uh, you ever watch Jackass? Yes. Remember when Steve-O, he went, like, the little webbing on his feet, he got, like, The paper. webbing on his feet, and he did here. Oh, my God. That must fucking hurt. Because, like, every time you walk, that shit continuously stretches out. Oh, yeah, nah, no, I think I'm, I'm getting a paper cut. Because this the bone, that... Fuck that, my nigga. Damn. I'm uncomfortable. That shit hurt. That shit, <laughs> that shit sound crazy. What <laughs> the fuck? 
Alright. Alright, so I have a couple holidays. I just randomly made in my mind. And I want you to know, like, would you pick these? Like, which holiday would you pick to get put into the calendar? Okay. Once a year. So, it's the purge. One of it's the purge. Can't say no day. Prisoner release day. Release of any animals day or switch jobs day. Some of them sound a lot more peaceful than others. I know. Just can't say no day is crazy. Do you know the <laughs> havoc that would happen? No, nah, that, that can't be done. <laughs> that, that is impossible. Yo, I know that some people that would abuse that power. It'd be done up. Like, I know, I know. All the weirdos are going to come out. Janae Aiko would be in my house with me, bro. Like, hi. <laughs> but, um. But it's like for your personal perf- personal preference. Do I have to choose one? Or are you saying, like, which ones would I accept? Which one wouldn't I? Uh, you have to choose one. Out of all. Well, I mean, the last one don't sound too bad. You switch jobs. Switch jobs for the day? Yeah. But, like, it's for the day, though. So when it goes away, you got to go back. I could go be a zookeeper. That's nothing compared to fucking I can't be, say I can no. A, you want to be a zookeeper? I could. That include, that include the president? Yeah. So, like, for that day, you can make so much shit happen. You could cause war. You could do anything. Same with with can't job, say no. Switch jobs. I with, know. With, uh, can't say no is crazy. Switch jobs. Wild. What's the name? A Lakers. I had to play with LeBron. Oh, you go be that. Oh, that's tough. I didn't even think about that. Yes, sir. Nah, you fine. That's fine. I'm gonna drop fifty. You go switch jobs with a Russell Westbrook. Oh yes, they they also need me at guard. <laughs> they, they need me. <laughs> Yo, nah, that's that's tough. I would do that. I would for real do that shit. Bro. I feel like prisoner release day and the purge day are almost virtually kind of the same thing. Yeah, it's, it's, release it's basically the, the sickos in prison versus the sickos that just didn't get caught and aren't in prison. But I mean, like you could release anybody in prison that you want. Is there any rappers in prison that niggas like K-Fly? Free Hoover. Who the fuck is Hoover? Who's Hoover? Larry, Larry Hoover? Hoover? Yeah. <laughs> nigga, what? You want to free that nigga? No, I don't, I don't even know who it is. It just had Kanye and Drake merch that said Free Hoover. They I had think, a little concert for him or whatever. I think he's like the... I, I seen a, a video on YouTube. He's one of the founders of BD. Yeah. he's like BD Mark. and Lamron in there? Yeah. I don't know what that means, to be honest. It's like a gang oh. in Chicago. Like He's the founders of the niggas. Um, <laughs> I don't, I'm trying to think. Is there anybody I really root free in jail? Oh, I don't think I have anybody. They good. Yeah, they good. They, they, <laughs> they, they, they good. <laughs> Release of all animals. I'm not gonna lie. What animal would I get? Um, an otter. But it's, it's so basic because I can have an otter right now. But that's my favorite animal. Do you think otters are so tough? I know. They, you release know, release of all animals. Isn't it? Like just release them from, from the zoo. Yeah, they're not getting them back. So you just saying freedom forever? I mean, I guess. Um, I mean, yeah. Like which ones do you have though? Mm. What I keep? Yeah, like you can take an animal, monkey. I mean, come on. Yeah. Oh, I'd take one of them little monkeys, the ones that be like the throwback zoo, like the big yeah. ass. Cake. I'm taking one of them. I want like a, a fair or a meerkat. Oh, a meerkat. Yeah. Mm. How about a prairie dog? No. The, like the same they're thing. They're dogs. No, they're not. No, they're not. Prairie dogs are like prairie dogs. Are like a I lake. think we discussed this already. They're Bro, brother, it's just like a prairie dogs are like rodents. Brother. They're not dumb. They're not, I'm we, thinking about coyotes. That's, nah. just, that's, just like, that's just like a squirrel. I'm thinking about coyotes. <laughs> we were discussing this it's before. Like a, it's, like, it's a groundhog. That's what I'm saying. That's a prairie dog. Yeah, it looks like a squirrel. I'm trying to think of something interesting. I would get an otter, though. Otters are so fucking tough, bro. They're predatory animals. They have opposable thumbs. They could. I think they're herbivores, meaning they could eat both meat and leaves. I just have them in my pool. Yeah. Just let them swim. They're so fucking tough. It's omnivore, would you say? Ob- uh, what I, 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 I some really dumb shit. I think I said or- orbivores. No, no herbivores is the said niggas omnivore. that omnivore. Yeah. No, he said I it's think that's omnivore. Right one. It's yeah. omnivore. That's the right one. That's I said right orb before. Orb before. Yeah, I sound like a fucking idiot. <laughs> but um, yeah, otters are tough as fuck. Mm. Very tough. But yeah, I think I'm picking switch jobs day. Yeah, I mean it's most peaceful and ah. coolest, most beneficial. But. But oh, I I have a question. This is mad random, but we were talking about animals. Mm. <clears throat> what do you think is the worst animal to be? Like, say you were an animal, which one would be like the worst? Chicken. Like to like to be no okay mm. yeah I mean that's that's true a chicken. Uh... I was thinking a dog. You know why? Because dogs are so close to humans, and like we can never like they can't tell us what's wrong with them, but like we we're so close to them. And we could fix whatever's wrong with them, but they can't speak to tell us, like, what's wrong. Like, a dog could, like, have a broken leg or some shit like that. Not a broken leg. That's Max, because you could tell. Like, they stomach could hurt, or they might be hungry as hell. But, like, we'll never know because they can't, like, physically say that shit unless, like, we've been around them all the time. Like, I'd be mad. It's like a, a, 
A domesticated bird is fucking garbage. A domesticated bird? You wanna know what they do? They stand there. <laughs> they just stand. They don't they don't lay down, they can't lay down, they just stand. No <sighs> flying, they're in a cage. Stand there. I mean, they, 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 can walk, they can walk around the house. Or like Yeah, if they let float, them. But... Floating around the house. Oh, like if you just like keep them in the cage? Yeah, mostly, yeah. Well, yeah, oh. that's the thing. Like you, They shouldn't keep them in the cage. A lot of bird owners just <laughs> sit in the laundry room in the cage <laughs> with a blanket over the cage. Yeah, no, you should let them out. I mean, they can like walk around. Yeah, you they, can. They can fly up but a some have. Bit. I mean, some have their wings clipped. I feel like a domesticated bird's show shit. Wait, they have the wings, but they can still like fly like up. Damn, that, must, like, that like is so mid, bro. I'd be so mad if Damn. I was a domesticated bird. That's ass. Yeah, so like, there's no point having them. So they can't. They really can't lay down. No. Well, do they die if they lay down? Oh, you think they? I've they never. Just... I've never heard of that. I just don't <laughs> think they. I don't. It's not that. I don't think it's that big. Of, birds don't lay down at all. Period. Even out in the wild, like. So they just like stand up. Like, yeah, oh yeah, yeah they, they stand up. They and sleep. rest. They rest on their feet. Yeah, but they oh, could like. They could at least like. They look. He sit like. They could lean on another bird. They have legs like dogs. They look. You like. Oh, okay. So feet. they just sit on their hind yeah. feet. Oh, okay. Oh, think... Nah, like my grandparents used to have a bird. Nigga, not not once left the cage. That boy was sitting in the laundry room, like, <laughs> easily like twelve years. For twelve years and died. <laughs> that was his <laughs> life, bro. Nigga sat in the laundry room, saw us when we walked in, and that was it. I mean, it's the same as fish. They swim in the. Yeah, same that's way. what I'm saying. Like goldfish is ass. They go left and right until they die. Yeah, but like, in about a week. <laughs> I feel like birds are a little bit smarter than. Goldfish. I had a goldfish for three years. He oh. survived three heart attacks. Oh. I, I First of all, how do you know your fish had a heart attack? Like he was, he was like floating above the cage, above the above the tank. You and then we just gave him medicine. I come back home from school. He's swimming again. They capped around my. I don't know. What they, the f- they flushed that one down the toilet. And got another goldfish. Nah, fish. nah. That thing was dead, bro. Yeah, they they probably, capped like shit. Key, they did that. Nah, chill. Oh, yeah, did chill, that. Nah, nah. I gotta ask my dad. I gotta ask my dad because Loki three times. <laughs> 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 you had a heart attack again? Wow. <laughs> Die. Nah, because there was really a time, like, I went to go feed him, like, right before school. I was, like, in seventh grade. And I'm like, his name was Goldberg. He he was, like, floating on top. I'm like, Dad, he's I think he's dead. And he's like, no, nah, no, nah. he's like, just go to school. And then he put the drops in, and I come back, he's swimming. I'm like, nah, he was dead. Nah, he's no way. Yeah. I got to ask my dad. There's no dead. way. He's dead. Oh. Yo, let me write that down. I'm about, I'm about to cop a fish. Why not? Huh? What, get a fish? Yeah, why not? You should get a ferret. I want a I ferret. I, that's so, what I said I wanted. No, so I actually, I <laughs> almost got a ferret, and then my mom blew my shit. She's like, the fuck are you going to do with a ferret? Realistically, what the fuck are you going to do? I said, you can sit on my shoulder. Yeah, they're cool. And that was it. That's all I had. I was like, damn, what else is he going to do? <laughs> like, you could just, like, run around the house. I heard they'd be stealing shit, though. Nah, they're slippery as fuck. That's the only reason I wouldn't, because that nigga would, he'd be gone. Like, we had a snake. When we moved to the new house, had a snake. I'm talking about the second day we were there, nigga's gone. He's in your house somewhere? He's dead as fuck right now, probably. 100% probably dead. <laughs> Nigga, he's probably in like a sock. Yeah. Like, like you bought that snake for that house. Oh, no, no, no. We've had, had it. it. Yeah, oh. we've been had it. And then you got to the other house, done up. Shit's like, gone. he was just not in the cage? Dead. How big was the snake? Uh, like a little garden it was, snake? It was a skinny one. Oh, okay. It was a king snake. Wow. My cousin had a, had a turtle one time. And he had two turtles. He had a fat one and a little one. And I guess he forgot to feed them. And the I was about to say, please don't tell me you lose a turtle. No, no. The the big one ate the little one. Like he bit the head off. And like you just see like his <laughs> like his headless body. No, that is Max. And like, <laughs> and it's funny because my so they used to keep him in the garage. And then one day my uncle was like cleaning out the garage and it was mad hot. And he left him outside. And that nigga, the big nigga cooked. Like he literally cooked in the in the sun. <laughs> he like burnt. They could have ate that. Why did he just go in the shell? I don't know. Like he's been, he was out there for a minute, like probably like probably hot day. as shit. In it shit. was like it was like nine. It was like a ninety degree day. Wait, that, that's actually torture, bro. He literally just got cooked alive, <laughs> <laughs> like a slow cook too. That is terrible. Bro. That's what I'm saying. You, think, was... you think they could they could scream? You think he was screaming? No, they can't. Nah, this they can't. Bro, if animals could scream, you would hear he them all scream. the time. No, he can't. Turtles scream. could definitely scream. No, he can't. Alright, bro. Just... A turtle cannot scream. Yes, they can. Can any animal scream? Maybe yes. like a maybe like a squirrel. You never like, heard, there, there's a video of a raccoon screaming. You want to see? Let me see if I can find that. That raccoon said, ah, like he grabbed <laughs> his head in wild. Oh, Were you looking up the turtle screaming? I'm looking up a raccoon scream because that video is so funny. I'm telling you, a turtle can't scream, bro. Wait for it. Yeah, send me that shit so I can put it on here. Got you. <laughs> Why the fuck you look like that? Wait. Just wait. Ha 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 
<laughs> you tell me these niggas, they can scream, bro. The niggas are crazy. Yo, nah, I didn't think. I mean, that might that might just be just how he sounds. <laughs> like, that might not be his scream. Like, that's just his uh, his form of a bark. Cats can scream too. I mean, yeah, that's like a screech, but turtles so definitely can. not That's not a turtle screaming. I'm about to find out. I haven't seen this video. They probably hiss. Stop, that's not stop a turtle. The cat. Stop <laughs> the cat. Stop. That's not a turtle. That turtle screams, bro. But yeah, deers probably live a bad life. Uh, I mean, they're pretty dumb. I know, but like they just like get so hunted by they, everything. I don't think they know that they live a bad life, but they're pretty dumb. Oh yeah. The little deer in headlights thing. Like that's because like they'll see a car come and go. And just look <laughs> and die. Hey, bro. All right. So. What else do I got? Oh, oh. Would you rather be hunted down by a retired U.S. Navy SEAL or a millionaire? I mean, if it's a millionaire, they're just going to hire the, That's what the, I'm the saying. Navy they SEAL. Can, so I'll take the Navy SEAL. You have a better chance of surviving with the Navy SEAL. Yeah, That's he, what I'm saying. He probably, he probably got less equipment. That nigga could probably just buy a fucking laser machine. <laughs> like, <laughs> like he, nah, low-key, a millionaire will like... Probably hire mad hitmen. I literally just watched. Oh, I was going to watch. There's a video. It's like this is like a killer series, like how he explains like the killer's lives or whatever. And it was like a millionaire that um no one knew actually killed. So apparently this millionaire was just killing niggas, and you would never know because millionaire. Why the yeah. fuck would he kill people? He was a serial killer. Really? I didn't watch the thing yet. Yeah, I didn't watch it all. Was it on Netflix? No, it's on um YouTube. Some dude just makes like murder documentaries. Mm. Did they say like who the the, the um millionaire was? Yeah, or yeah, he got caught. But who the fuck would ever suspect a millionaire? That's what I'm just saying, being a silly, bro. Like, serial killer. That's crazy. Like, what? Like, he was just hiring niggas, or he was a. I think he was doing it himself. Oh, he was doing it himself. Yeah. Oh, that's sick. But would you ever suspect it? I don't think. Like, I Elon would. Musk, for all we know, could be killing people just because. Because how would we know? He just find a hobo off the street, and no one would ever know. That's what I'm saying. Because like they have all that money, they could cover up hella shit. Mm-hmm. Shit. Like you know, like on the dark web, it only costs like twelve thousand dollars, like or ten thousand dollars for a hitman. Hitmen are crazy. That's what I'm saying. So, if a millionaire... A, you have to be a slick... You have to be a disconnected human to be a hitman. Hey, there's probably ex... And smart as fuck. There's probably ex-Navy SEAL niggas doing that shit for $10,000? That's you ever, it? You ever heard of the story that um the girl hired a hitman to kill her? Like, herself. Kill herself? She, she couldn't kill herself. So, she wanted somebody to come in the house and kill her, like, when she wasn't expecting it. Wait, how'd the story go? That shit sound crazy. Oh, uh, I don't I don't remember. It was a long time ago. But there's a, a girl who wanted to kill herself. She wanted to die. So she hired a hitman to kill her, but some shit went wrong. I think she like, called it off last minute, but she couldn't, and like he came in, killed her and the parents, or some shit like that. So why? So she wanted to die, but she didn't yeah. want to do it herself. No, but why kill the parents too? Yeah, I don't know. Guess witnesses. The hitman shit. Yeah, probably. That's nuts. I seen just recently some black lady, like hired a hired a hitman for twelve thousand dollars to kill her ex husband, her ex husband's wife, and it actually worked. That's max. Like, she actually did that shit. I'm imagine like, being so jealous. <laughs> you imagine, like, this. That's sick. Like, why would you do that? Hey, bro. Down yeah, bad, bro. Hey, money can really buy you anything as well. Bro. No, literally. That's what I'm saying. So, like, people say money can't buy you happiness, but, like, real talk, nigga, what can't you have if you have money? That's true. But, all right. So, what animal fully grown can you fight by yourself? But the thing is, it can't be a farm animal, so it can't be, like, a, a pig. A dolphin? Like, oh, and it has to weigh more than you. But it ha- it's attacking you, though. A dolphin. A dolphin? Do I have any weapons? Nah, barehanded. Under under a certain... Yeah, it's a dolphin. You gonna kill a dolphin? Easily. How you killing it? I'm putting my fucking, like, fingers in its blowhole, and I'm ripping that motherfucker. I don't think you could physically Bro. do you that. You don't think so? No. Nah, right. I think you, you gotta be strong there's as hell. N- there's niggas that... Uh, you never heard, like, the adrenaline that kicks in right before, like, when you're about to die or whatever? Like, dude pushed a boulder, like, three times his weight off of him because, like, the adrenaline kicked in. Really? Yeah. That's a thing. <sighs> I don't know. I killed a dolphin. I'll kill, like, those little emu things. Like, you know, it's like, <laughs> a, the little emus. How much do they weigh? I think they weigh, like, let me see. It's probably, like, 250. Yeah! Because I know, I know an ostrich weighs, like, 300. Are you dead ass? A full-grown ostrich is huge, bro. Yeah, our ostrich is, like, seven feet tall. Yeah. You don't think you get pecked to death? Ooh, that's a terrible way to die. I think you get pecked to death. I think so. They have to be strong and stuff. Like, their legs are, are pretty strong, too, because they run fucking fast. I know. But, like, 
that beak probably like solid. That's what I'm saying. Like imagine that shit hit you in the face. Oh my god. I don't know if I can take an emu. An emu is like oh no, it's only eighty two pounds. Oh never mind. I need something heavier than that. I'm trying to think what else I could kill. An ostrich is one forty to three twenty. What the fuck are you on about? You're getting smirked. A mountain lion, Jacob? I'm gonna take it in his mouth. <laughs> I should just catch your foot and eating it for like, he's gonna like eat a snack. Your mouth. If he's running towards me, I'm like, this kid coming from up, he's flipping. He's you ever had you, a chewy, you ever had a chewy bar? You know, like a little chewy nature bars. That's what he's doing to your leg. Like the same <laughs> wow. way you take a bite of that. That's what he's you doing. act like you play soccer. Like you, you kick that strong. No, you yeah. got Tim's on or something. Yeah, even All with right, steel bro. plated boots, you're not. Yeah, doing that, bro. low key. But you could rip a dolphin up like you're some kind of I think Superman. So. I really <laughs> think I could rip a dolphin. I could, I could, I think I could. That's literally Superman type stuff, like ripping people in half. <laughs> I could rip a dolphin. Ripping man. flesh in half. Nah, I'll, that's a blubber. Yeah, because that shit's strong. If I yeah. Force my it's, fingers it's like, in there. It's like, like ripping a tire in half. You think you can rip a tire? That sounds crazy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, if there's no, a hole bro. in the tire, I'm not saying like I fucking bro, pierce you, it with bro, my it finger. Bro, it could be a big ass hole. You're still not ripping it. I could. With enough adrenaline, yes. Bro, adrenaline, like adrenaline's crazy. Yeah, but you're not turning I mean, Superman, bro. I feel like I could, I could, I could do a lot off adrenaline. Like an adrenaline shot, I could take a lot of animals. Maybe even a gorilla. Maybe. No, you can't. Yeah, can. <laughs> you can't. Off adrenaline, I'm just as strong as he is. Like if you take like you them little shots they be giving me. Yes. Like, nah, I'm talking about crazy. a crazy adrenaline shot. I'm rocking a gorilla. You're crazy. Yeah. How long do you think that will last? I don't know. How, uh, I don't know. It's a good question. Nigga, you dying from a you fighting a gorilla like just put you in a cage with a gorilla, you gonna win? You don't think like a, a pro UFC fighter could uh beat a gorilla? Ooh, that's a good question. I ain't gonna lie. Like like, like uh who's John you? Jones. Mm. Yeah, maybe he might like <sighs> very well maybe be low key. If John Jones hits a gorilla hard enough, he might like the girl might be like ah you don't want to fight no more. But like if the gorilla takes him down, it might be that's that's a cool. I was about to say maybe you could break its limbs, but I feel like you're not breaking a gorilla's limbs. Yeah, I know that shit. Got... You get off your best punch. I feel like the gorilla's just gonna eat it. How about it might make it more mad too. What if I punch it in the nose, it might make it more mad. The nose is sensitive on like most animals and us too. Yeah. Like how if I you, punch, how are you reaching it? Low key, they have fast reflexes, so I mean. I would want to see that though. I've you, never seen you try to get a hard enough punch off. That but shit I've, be slow. I've never seen a gorilla like weave a punch like. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> they probably know they shit not gonna do nothing. To be like, all right, bro, just hit me. I don't know. I'm trying to think of anything else. That's How about grown. plus they also bite, so they bite in your hand. And oh no, yeah, they're, 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 um, their 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 jaw strength is insane. How about a kangaroo? I think we could be. I think I could kill a kangaroo. I don't know. I think it would break my ribs if it kicked me. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like I'm I gotta just don't get hit. <laughs> That's what <we're laughs> no, for them the kick they 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 yeah, jump they, so just dodge it. Bro. They have to go on their they go on their tail and then spring yeah. up. And they dodge that shit. So strong. That's low key. They crawl under them and then choke them. They're, they're strong. Crawl under them. <laughs> I'm not crawling under no goddamn kangaroo. He's gonna be on the same tail, thing though. I'm, put, I'm putting my hand in this pouch and I'm ripping it in half. Okay, you might have a better chance of doing that. I guess, but what's that gonna do? <laughs> Tearing that thing to shreds. He's gonna be in so much pain. He's not gonna know that he's gonna be wow. He's still, gonna be, your, in he's pain. still gonna be your ass. Animals be fighting through pain. That's true. You think you beat ten turtles? Like what? It's ten turtles. Like all little coming t- at you. Little turtle? No, big. Like the not tortoise? Huge, not huge, but like big. Like sea turtles? No. Yeah. Or do they pose a threat to me? I mean, I take them one by one. Just flip them over. Dude, they, can, <laughs> they, they can literally snap your Achilles like easily. If they bit your Achilles, yeah, done up. I, mean, I don't think. Like, really, in the water? I just look at them walking. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'll give, I'll give us the disadvantage in the water because oh, on no. land it might in be the water they won, I'm not. Yeah, I think they kill. If they bite me, they might. They're going to bite my hand yeah, off. Um, you can't really. I feel like they do the same on land. No. No, they're not catching they're, they're me. Not Ten is crazy. Ten they, is not catching me. It doesn't catching. matter how money. They're, like, they're not that I'm fast. not saying you have to run. You have to fight them. Oh. It's either you or the turtle. You know what I'm doing? I'm picking one up and just throwing that nigga. I'm. I'm literally walking I'm walking around. I'm, and they're I'm coming back. And I'm, they're coming back. It's not done until you kill all of them. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to take one by defense, one. I'm going to you know flip them the, and stomp on their head. That's a fight of endurance. <laughs> they could outlast you. Bro, they're moving slow. I'm, you're locked in a room with 10 turtles. How it's, big is the room? It's not done up. <laughs> this room. Yeah, this room. Oh, so then then they may, may, may be. Turtles. 10 turtles They're not locked killing in me. Room. They're not killing me. Right, who could last longer? The I'm, minute you're going to go, I want to go for this one. He hides in his shell. What are you doing? I'm picking them up. You're not breaking the shell. I'm throwing them on something. There's no way I'm dying to ten turtles. No way I'm no way I'm gonna die to ten turtles. I might die some ass way, like if I'm in war, like a grenade. But I'm not dying to turtles. I'll die of starvation, waiting for them to come out their shells. (laughs) I'm saying it's a test of endurance. I think the turtles win. You serious? 
But you gonna possible. rip a blowhole? I could rip. I'm t- give me an adrenaline shot. I'm ripping a blowhole with some <laughs> easy money. Yo, that's superhuman strength, my nigga. That's not superhuman. Yeah, what it literally is. <laughs> like, I feel like there's plenty of strong men out there that could rip a tire in half with a given hole. I don't off know. adrenaline. I feel like that shit, that that strong shit. I feel like that shit's only with like that certain motion. I think I could do it. I, nah, like I seen, I seen niggas in the gym get thrown two twenty five and they curl that shit. Like thrown, he's standing up, he catches it, curl. I don't think he could still do that. I don't know. Because I feel like, I feel like it's the mo. Like they could do shit like that because they practice that motion. But this nobody, like, what does this work out your back? Yeah, but that's grip strength as well. Like yeah. mount, that's like, like your chest. Like a rock climber might be able to do. Hell no, no, not a skinny. Off adrenaline, ass. their grip strength is crazy. That is straight grip strength. Grip. How how big is a blowhole? Is it like I don't. It's, I feel like it's not that big. I, I don't think know. it's like it's probably like this. I've never seen a blowhole in cool. person. Yeah, you squeeze your fingers in there and you fucking just. But you're in the water, so can you do that with that straight upper body? You ain't got no leverage, nothing. So you're just gonna be floating, kicking. That's what I'm saying. We'd be above water. All right, all right. <laughs> Listen, if you think I'm dumb enough to take the dolphin underwater for that long, you're crazy. I'm staying afloat. We looking down, oh, waiting for him. What? That I'm gonna grab him and embrace him. We're gonna swim through the water. Long. I'm gonna locate the blowhole. I'm ripping. Uh, I right. fucking Superman. Yeah, literally, that's what I said. Superman. <laughs> we, we, he he goes up for water. I'm locating his eyes and I'm pressing him in. He's blind now. What's he doing? Wow. Done up. <laughs> and I'm I'm stretching his eye hole out to the size of my fist and I'm reaching in and grabbing his heart. Spotify. We're not. We love animals. We we're not <laughs> we're not we don't hate animals. This is not an animal hate podcast. This is just a scenario. Of I that. donate to life Pina. or death. I think I adopted an animal one time. I would. I'll adopt. An I have animal. two dogs. I love them very much. Exactly. I'll adopt a little panda bear, like you know they do from the zoos and shit. I would. But I'll adopt a ferret. No, you better buy that. You been? Oh yeah, yeah. My bad. I was thinking of something other shit. But all right. so if you if we all so say it's us three, right? We all had Superman's powers, like everything he has. Would you would we ra- would you rather fight um all the gods in Mount Olympus? Like from God of War and shit like that. Don't all th- all them niggas, would you rather do that one? Or fight um King Kong and Godzilla and all the monsters from those movies? Like you know all them big monsters they I'd fought. I'd rather fight King Kong and King all Kong. I'm See, evaporating I would, them. I would fight them, but I feel like that's too easy. That's very easy. That's what I'm saying. I'd rather go to the Niggas oh, at well, the gods. Challenge? Yes, but us three. You don't think us three with Superman not, powers can be beat honest, the gods, no, we're bro? Because they they're like they're above. They're above Superman. Bro, we can fuck Zeus they up. They are bro. gods. So gods. we technically gods too. We're not fucking Zeus up, bro. We each have powers. I'm of pretty Superman. sure you know many has? if Superman got hit with like however many volts of electric, like pure electricity, lightning itself. Through his body, we're torched. Bro, toast. we're gonna dodge that shit. I mean, it's like a gauntlet, so we're gonna we gotta get Poseidon, all them niggas. Yeah, Poseidon's fucking rocking us too. What? Nigga, we killing Poseidon. We can control all water, technically. Bro, I'm in the air, bro. Exactly. We could kill Poseidon, bro. Bro, Poseidon, I'm not even worried about him, to be You're honest. crazy. Poseidon's lit. If that nigga all from sea Ga- life? Yes. Bro, I'm not worried about Poseidon, but we just yeah. have to talk about him. <laughs> <We're> <laughs> not, bro. bro, if Kratos could f- kill all the. Kratos is Kratos is the only challenge in Zeus. The rest of them, like, what are we talking about? No, we're not fighting Kratos. We're just fighting all the... Wait, what was Kratos? What was his, like... What was he, the god of war, right? Oh, you said Kratos. He's thinking. not He's not an actual god. He's not god an actual of war, god. God of War was, technically is Ares. Ex- Hades is also crazy. I was thinking The like god Kronos. of the underworld? He's Kronos. literally the god of the dead. Kronos, god of time. We could kill him, bro. Mm, he manipulates time. To we'll his find will. a way, bro. Oh. We can find a way. Even the sleep man, the god of sleep. All right, what if we had Kratos with us? Oh, it's easy money. Oh, it's easy money yeah, now? Kratos, what the hell? Like, I could go with Kratos right now. We're chilling. Bro, Superman's stronger than Kratos, bro. Kratos <laughs> is decimating Superman. Bro, stop. No, it, he's not. What the fuck? Kratos killed... He killed Kronos like the Titan, not the God of Time. The Titan yeah, Kronos. Yeah, so Superman. Kronos are... He was in that. Titans in mythology are like the very first beings. They are above gods. And he killed him. Get the fuck out of here. I think we could, I think if we had Superman powers, literally, Superman is literally like Zeus is soloing Superman. Bro, Superman's trolled Kratos, but he can fly with a bunch of other stuff. Nah. That's what I'm saying, bro. We could do it. That would be lit, bro. Fighting gods, we might go down at the the top, but we're gonna we gonna kill a couple gods, bro. We gonna kill a couple. We of kill them. some, but not all. No shot. 
Shit. No fucking way. Because the, the King Kong and Godzilla, that's just too easy. That's way too easy. That's too easy. You decimate those niggas. Nigga, we could kill them niggas in like five minutes. Laser beam. Like, what? Up. Like, we could... King Kong is done up for him. For real? Literally, it could just be one-on-one. Godzilla, maybe two-on-one, but still, he gonna die. I need the challenge, bro. I'm not gonna lie. We'll go... We could, we could kill the gods, bro. All right, what if... um? See, I'm not, I'm not jacking it. Because if we're Superman... Do we have kryptonite power? Like the kryptonite weakness? Yeah. I mean, up. What, they have kryptonite? Hermes, or what is it? Hermes or uh, Apollo, the messenger god? He's going to plant krypton. <laughs> grabbing kryptonite. Bro. We're folding. <laughs> we're folding. Nah, bro. Yeah, that nigga's getting killed first then. That's the I ain't dying. You you good, you guy? You know yeah. how fast he is? He's the fast, fast Superman? I don't know. Cap. <laughs> uh, I tell you what, I mean, in some Superman. That he... Bro, Superman low key got all their powers, bro. That's what I'm saying. We are other, Superman. Other than, like, I don't think so, bro. The gods are taking down Superman. I don't think so, bro. I think we good. I think we can... We can... We gonna knock off most of them. Hades can't die. We gonna find a way. And a P. All right, we about... This might be... It might be over, over anyway. Yeah. Just hold this over. <laughs> but... So you think... So you just gonna take the King Kong in them? You're not gonna do Real, the gods? No, because I'm not beating the gods. I don't care what you guys say. You're not beating the gods. They are gods. Technically, in God term, you can't kill like, you can't kill a god unless you are a god. Bro, Kratos did it, bro. We're technically gods. We're supermen. We're supermen, not men. I don't. Superman is basically a god. That's what I'm saying, bro. But that's tough. So Jakai, you you find the gods with me, bro? Yeah. Oh, all right. right. I'm gonna see you guys in hell. <laughs> hey, bro, I'm taking Hades too. Mm. That's what I'm saying. We gonna you can't kill Hades. We find somebody. If Hades puts you in the river of sticks, you're dead. You know, like, when you go to the river, you separate from your body. It's just your soul stuck down there. You can't do anything. You can't leave. First of all, we're not gonna. He can't get us, bro. Right. We straight, bro. Right. We got all. We we're technically guys, bro. Good luck. Hey, bro. But you got anything else you want to talk about, my brother? Um, nah. How about you, Jakai? No. Got anything? All right. Well, thank y'all for tuning in for another episode of No Regulars Podcast, episode number twenty six. And a shout out to my brothers again for pulling up, Jakai. Thank you, my brother. Enjoy your um. Your big boy job, man. Yes, sir. Big shout out to G5, bro. <laughs> shout to miss G- him. Yeah, man. Hey, maybe we might have a podcast over a Zoom one day. Or if you come back in the summertime. Are you going to visit? Yeah. All right. Yeah, my family's sent out here, so. Nah, I heard you, heard you. But if you haven't already, man, follow all the socials down below. We're going to put it in the description. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Remember, 1K subscribers and 100,000 on TikTok. We'll be dropping merch, bro. You know what I'm saying? And if you haven't already, like it. Shit, I'm freaking I'm dying over here. Like the like the video, hit the post notification button, and oh yeah, I almost forgot. All my audio listeners, if you haven't already, if you want to, you could write us a review or you could just rate the show. You know what I'm saying? It goes. It's a little bit of work, but it goes a long way for us because it, it puts us in the recommended. So that's if you want to, you could. If you don't, then that's tough. But we different, they regular man, no regular Oh wait, we I'm different, they regular, no regular man, gangsta I'm gonna really go get it, yeah I'm gonna really go get it, yeah I'm gonna really go get it